everybody, I'm back. It's time for another beer review. And this time we go up to the great state of Oregon and we have Great Notion Brewery. This one's called Juice Junior. I wonder if it's like that old rat song, Way Cool Junior. Probably not, they probably don't have anything in common. Why would they have anything in common? And Way Cool Junior wasn't one of their better songs either. And they, if you don't like rat, you probably don't care. If you do, you're probably going, yeah, you're probably right. It's popular, but not a great song. Uh, super cool can, by the way. Made with tons of mosaic. And is that Jesus? Hey, I don't know if that's Jesus or not on the can. I'm not positive. Nah. Looks like just some dude with a long beard who took off his top hat. And then there's another littler dude that looks like him in his top hat. What if that guy takes off his t top hat? What happens then? And this is gonna end up being one of the like Russian nesting doll things, where you just keep taking them off and they keep getting smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller until, you know, at some point you, get, you, you gotta stop. Anyway, let's go ahead and crack this thing open. IPA uh, made with mosaic, which is nice. I like mosaic a lot. So let's go ahead and give this I love the cans. Just the cans kill me. All these guys come up with great, great cans. I mean, they're, they're, they can be pretty goofy uh, like this. I mean, who would expect to take your top hat off? I mean, who wears a top hat anyway? <laughs> no one wears a top hat anymore. Who's the last guy you could think of that wears a top hat? Slash? I mean, sl and sl like, to be honest, Slash pulled it off. I don't know if people can... You, I, can you imagine me I just rolling in here with a top hat? No, not going to work. Probably only a couple guys that could pull off a top hat. Uh, Abe Lincoln pulls off a top hat. And Slash, I don't know how Slash pulled off a top hat, but Slash pulled off a top hat with a nose ring to boot. So let's go ahead and give this a, uh, a pull. And... Oh. Ooh, that's kind of light. I like that one. That's one of those ones you can, I don't, I don't see the, uh, the alcohol content on this thing, but my guess would be it can't be much higher than the the mid sixes somewhere. Is that it? Yeah, six. Uh, that, that, yeah, it just seems like one of those beers you could probably, I, you know, I call them barbecue beers. Mowing the lawn beers, if you're into that sort of thing. I'm not, but if you're out there and you're sweating a little bit and you want to have a, a couple beers, you know, the session beers are probably in your, in the fours, four and a half, low fours, something like that. And what, what they're trying to do with the session beers is put the hops in there, but not the alcohol content. Because with a lot of the beers, the, the, you get the big hop beers. Those are like sevens and eights, and those are, you know, you have one or two of those, and that's, that's about it. You start going three and four deep, you're looking for a nap is what you're looking for. This one's at six, so you go out there, barbecue some steaks up, have a couple of these, and uh, you're feeling pretty good about yourself. I want to thank our good friends down at South Winchester Barbecue, as always. Great barbecue, great beer. In fact, that's exactly where this beer came from. They go out of their way to find hard to find beers, bring them to the store. That way you don't have to do the legwork. They've already thought of it for you. And while you're there, you can grab some good barbecue. If you have a dog, you say, I wanna take my dog for a walk, I wanna take my... Bring them on. They're all, it's all good there. Bring your dog, hang out in the patio, grab some barbecue and some beers. And the cool thing about it is too, like I didn't even know anything about this brewery. Nothing. Again, I dig the can. But great nation up in Oregon. Uh, and that's the cool thing about getting to try different beers from different breweries. You just don't know. You have no idea. I mean, there's so many of them out there. And Oregon is just, I mean, they got tons, tons of great beers up there. Uh, many, many of them I haven't even tried. This was one of them. So uh, I'm glad I got a chance to try this one. And I'm actually gonna be going to Oregon in a couple months for a little vacation. So uh, trust me, I will be looking for this while I'm up there. I suggest you do as well. One of their good friends at South Winchester Barbecue once again for sponsoring this fiasco.